You have things He's going to lie to you. You're made overcomers by the blood of the Lamb. And by the word of your testimony. Thank you for your patience today. It's important that we read the word. Amen. And not get in a hurry. For the life of the flesh is in the blood. Leviticus 17 and 11. Everybody say, for the life of the flesh is in the blood. And I have given it to you among the altar, upon the altar, to make an atonement for your souls. For it is the blood that maketh an atonement for the soul. There's life in the blood. Leviticus 17 and 11. One more scripture before you're seated. Exodus chapter 12. Exodus chapter 12. Praise God. And verse 22. Acts, or excuse me, Exodus 12 and 22 says, And ye shall take a bunch of hyssop and dip it in the blood that is in the basin, and strike the lintel and the two side posts with the blood that is in the basin, and none of you shall go out at the door of his house until the morning. The blood was applied to the doorpost. The death angel was coming. Amen. It would pass over them as long as the blood was applied. I mean, you can't leave the blood in the container. You can't leave it in the basin. It's time to dip into the blood, amen, and to apply it to our lives. Would you lift your hands and in your own way, would you thank God for His blood? Hallelujah, Jesus. Hallelujah. Thank you for your blood, Lord. No fancy title today. No fancy words. There's nothing that needs to be added to the subject of your blood. Thank you for dying on the old rugged cross. Thank you for your blood today. Hallelujah, Jesus. Hallelujah, Jesus. Amen. You can be seated this morning. I want us to sing that first song this morning. There's nothing but the blood of Jesus. Amen. So what can, can wash away my sins? Nothing but the blood of Jesus. What can make me hold again? Nothing but the blood of Jesus. Is the blood that makes me white as snow? No other doubt I know is nothing but the blood of Jesus. Oh, precious is the Thank you for your blood, Jesus, that is applied to the doorpost of my heart. There's nothing but the blood of Jesus. Hallelujah. Oh, the blood of Jesus, how precious and powerful is that flow, my friend. It's sacred. It gives us strength from day to day. It will never lose its power. It's the blood of Jesus. Everybody say the blood of Jesus. The blood should continually be talked about. It should be continually be taught and preached. It's the blood. Modern day religion tends to nudge it to the side. But I want to keep preaching about it. Amen? I want to keep telling people about the blood of Jesus Christ. The cross. The crown of thorns. Amen? It's nothing to avoid today. It's something to be a part of our lives. The price that was required to wash away your sins. There's nothing but the blood of Jesus. It's important to all of us here today. You're made up of blood. Amen. 
The blood is where life is found and experienced. It's the blood of Jesus. For the life of the flesh is in the blood. The Red Cross and others constantly are having blood drives. There's always a need for blood. The physician that operated on Brother Howe on Friday, he came out and gave myself and the family the report of the surgery. He told us a few of the details and he said something that caught my attention. He said, we took out quite a bit of blood before we had the surgery. After the surgery was completed, we put that blood back in to his body. There's something about fresh blood. Amen? There's always a need for blood. When it comes to our lives, we need the blood applied to our lives every day. Amen? The blood of Jesus, what does it do for us? It washes us. It cleanses us. Amen? It sanctifies us. It delivers our soul from the bondage of sin. It gives us salvation. It comes through the blood. Leviticus 17 and 11. For the life of the flesh is in the blood. For many centuries, physicians practiced the treatment of bleeding a suffering patient. They would puncture a vein and allow blood to drain. As recently as the 18th century, physicians believed that bleeding relieved the patient of bad blood or impurities responsible for the disease or sickness in their body. George Washington died from a bleeding that was administered to his body by physicians as a treatment for a cold. There's something about blood, amen? Further studies in anatomy and medicine prove this practice to be wrong. In fact, just the opposite was affirmed. Rather than extracting blood from patients' bodies and lives, lives are saved by giving them a blood transfusion. There is life in the blood. Amen. For the life of the flesh is in the blood today. Where there is no blood, there is no life. Where there is no blood, there is no breath. There is no movement. Where the blood abides, there is hope. There is mercy. There is love. Amen. A church that removes the blood of Jesus from sermons is a dead church. A church that removes the blood from songs is a lifeless church. A church that removes the blood from prayers and devotion is a dying church. I don't know about you, but I don't want to be a corpse. Amen? I want to be alive. I want the blood of Jesus to be applied to my life every day. We need the blood in our lives. Can we lift our hands and thank Him for the blood of Jesus? Come on, think about the blood this morning. Think about the blood this morning. The blood of Jesus. What can wash away our sins? What can make us whole again? Nothing but the blood. Nothing but the blood of Jesus. Nothing but 
but the blood, nothing but the blood of King Jesus. Oh, we thank you, we thank you for the blood. It's okay to stop yeah, and praise him. We you. praise you for it's okay the to blood. Say thank you for the blood. Thank you for salvation that comes. Nothing thank you for washing our sins away. Nothing but your blood. Jesus. What can wash? What can wash? It gives us life. It gives us an abundant life. It gives us a new life. It washes away the sins of our life. Nothing but the blood. Nothing but the blood of Jesus. It wash and wash. There's no substitute for that. Would you pray that? There's nothing but the blood of Jesus. There's nothing but the blood of Jesus. There's no substitute. Nothing takes its place. With a sin issue, there has to be blood. Hallelujah, Lord Jesus. Andre Crouch years ago wrote a song that says, The blood that Jesus shed for me. Way back. On Calvary. It's the blood that gives me strength from day to day. It will never lose its power. It's the blood of Jesus, my friend. It soothes my doubts and it calms my fears. The same blood dried all my tears. The blood that gives me strength from day to day. It will never lose its power. For it reaches to the highest mountains and it flows from the lowest valleys. That blood that gives me strength will never lose its power. Praise God. Are you thankful for the blood of Jesus? Hallelujah. The blood of Jesus does so much in our lives. For this is my blood of the New Testament. Matthew 26 and 28. Which is shed for many for the remission of sins. Acts 20 and 28 says the church of God which... He hath purchased with His own blood. It's the blood, church, that makes the difference. It brings peace and reconciliation to God, according to Colossians 1 and 20. It has obtained eternal redemption for us, according to Hebrews chapter 9 and verse 12. Are you thankful for the blood of Jesus? It's the means by which we enter the most holy place with boldness. It's because of the blood of Jesus, amen, that the veil was cut. It was rent in two. Amen? And we were given the privilege today to stand in His presence, to step into the Holy of Holies, and to feel that love and compassion that we feel in this place. Would you just close your eyes and say, Thank you, Lord, for Your blood. Hallelujah. It's all right to just thank Him today. Hallelujah, Jesus. Lord, we praise You, Jesus. Hallelujah, hallelujah, Jesus. It's the blood of Jesus. It makes the difference, church. It's the blood that Jesus shed for your sins today. Isaiah 1 and 18 puts it this way. Come now, let us reason together with the Lord. Though your sins be as scarlet, they shall be white as snow. Red like crimson. They shall be 
as wool. Brother Luke Levine touched on this in the revival in the first of the year. He preached on the power of the blood of Jesus. And he mentioned how that you don't take a red shirt and try to dye it to make it white. It's pretty much impossible. Yet with the blood of Jesus, it can make you white as snow. can wash away your sins. Aren't you thankful for the blood of Jesus? Nothing but the blood washes your heart white as snow. Though your sins be as scarlet, they shall be white as snow. Red, though they be red like crimson, they shall be as wool. Why the blood? Why the cross? Why the crown of thorns? The stripes laid upon his back. Why all of the pain? Amen. It was for your sins. Amen. All have sinned and come short of the glory of God. Romans chapter 3 and verse 23. That's the reason for the cross. That's the reason for the blood. Amen. Colossians 1 and 13. Who hath delivered us from the power of darkness. If you're walking in darkness today, there's a light that he wants to shine in your heart. And it comes through the blood of Jesus. It doesn't come through a motivational message. Amen. It doesn't come through just a beautiful song. But it comes when you find an altar of repentance. And you say, God, I need you to wash me. And to cleanse me. And to make me white as snow. Though your sins be as scarlet, they shall be white as snow. Praise God. Amen. I want us to sing this song. Amen. Amen. Focus on the blood today. In the name of Jesus. Seated above, enthroned in the Father's love. Would you close your eyes and think about His blood today? Destined to die. Jesus. Hold out for all mankind. Thank you for your blood today, Jesus. Thank you for your blood. God's only Son. Perfect in spite this world. Hallelujah, Lord Jesus. He never sinned. Thank you, Jesus. But suffered as if he did. Hallelujah. All of the world. Every Think about that blood today, church. Hallelujah. 
stand this morning? Can we all stand and lift our hands? This is the way we're going to overcome. It's by the blood of the Lamb. We will overcome by the blood of the Lamb. The word of our testimony. It's by the blood church. wants to overcome. This altar is open. You're tired of the accuser of the brethren. Bring it before the throne. Let the blood be applied to your life. Overcome. We've overcome. Blood. Man. By the blood of the Lamb. The, of the, the word of the testimony. The word of the testimony. Oh, Does anybody want to come forward this morning? Say, God, I need more of that blood in my life. I need the blood applied to the doorpost of my heart. I need the blood. Honor and glory. The blood. The blood. You, nothing's going to move you. If the blood of Jesus doesn't move you this morning, there's nothing going to change you. Let the blood be a positive heart. The blood of Jesus. Let the blood be a positive heart. Worthy of honor and glory. Glory. It's the blood. It's the blood. Let the blood be applied. Hallelujah. Jesus. Oh, the blood. Power forever. Oh, hallelujah. you're facing today deal and deliverance salvation it covers everything today if you have a need in your life this is your time to get victory I want you to step out and come to the front whatever the need is I challenge you I admonish you as a preacher of the gospel to apply the blood to your life praise God if you have a need today don't push the cross aside don't leave this place without your victory today. We've sung about it. We've preached about it. Now let's respond to the blood. Amen. It gives life to those who consume it. It is the blood of the New Testament that is shed for many. It's the blood, my friend. Amen. Whatever you're facing right now, I want you to speak it right now. Lift your hands. Come on, by faith. And I want you to ask the Lord to apply the blood to your heart. Come on. Whatever you need from the Lord, say, God, I need your blood to cover me. It's the beginning of something great, my friend. It's the blood of Jesus. The blood of Jesus. Would somebody plead the blood of Jesus over your family, over your job situation, over your finances? If you need healing today, it doesn't matter what it is. Let Jesus cover it with His blood today. Come on. I need that blood in my life. I've carried this sin too long. God, watch me. Cleanse me. Change me. Make me white as snow. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Jesus, what 